They've just added Nuketown back into this game, which I've been playing since launch. As you can see, I'm level 53, so I'm a little bit behind um, basically a lot of people that have been playing. But I've just been kind of like chilling, going through the assault rifles. I'm not really hard pushing for the um, mastery camo at the moment. I'm just kind of like playing and having fun as I go, I guess. I do have Terminus Easter egg completed, uh, as you can see as my calling card. And I've also done the Liberty Falls one and yeah so they were pretty cool i did enjoy the terminus one um but liberty falls is not really as bad as everyone's kind of like making it out to be i guess i don't know like sure the atmosphere is a little multiplayer-ish but we knew that it was going to be like that a terminus easter egg was actually really fun i did that one with a full squad um so that was pretty cool and i'm pretty sure that the difficulty scales with it uh when you do that but yeah, it was pretty fun still. Uh, the Liberty Falls one I did with just myself and one other friend. Um, but yeah, there's going to be uh, ones coming up out about both of those uh, within, I don't know, the next couple of days probably. It depends on how long it takes me to edit them. But yeah, I just wanted to get a multiplayer video out too because I feel like... I don't know I just I don't know it feels I feel like I haven't in a while and I, I wanted to even though this game is going horrifically but um, you know showcasing the new map and everything like that um, I do have a couple of gold guns already um, like I said I'm working on the assault rifles at the moment yeah I haven't really pushed for anything else I almost have the Sigma done as well I think for the Sigma all I have to do is get the three score streak destructions in a game however many times I think it's ten times uh, and then I've got that one gold and I'm still working on the healer I think is the other one that's the one that doesn't have the lock on so that one I've been kind of using mainly in hardcore face-off just because like you know most people don't seem to be running flak jacket, um, at least in hardcore. I don't know why they wouldn't be, but I mean, I guess I'm, am I? That's what I'm running because the recon perk is disgustingly OP. Um, I don't know if you, you guys have probably heard discussions on that. Look, you literally get like free wall hacks. It's kind of, it's kind of insane, honestly. And it's like the perks that you can put in that category even are good anyway. So like, it's not even like you're sacrificing and using terrible perks just to get like <laughs> the bloody wall hacks. So to God. But like they're actually decent perks as well. I mean, Enforcer is pretty good as well when you get that specialist going because like, you know, it basically just gives you quick fix and everything like that. But I I'm wondering when they're gonna, um, nerf it because they've got to surely like there's been so much discussion about it i feel like it's definitely gonna happen maybe around like season one or something like that but yeah with those zombies ones i'm not entirely sure how i want to um also my multiplayer aim is trash because uh like i said i have been playing bloody zombies for a while because you get so much xp and at the moment there's double xp running i think when i completed the terminus easter egg it gave me like a hundred and six thousand xp which is just <laughs> actually ridiculous when you think about that yeah it's this one he1 not the healer I, I called it the wrong name but yeah trying to get score streak like kills well not kills but uh destructions using that one i found the most luck uh has been to use it on the counter uavs opposed to the uavs i think that the c uavs move a little bit slower at least that's what it feels like i don't know if it is actually true or not um but yeah like i was saying with the zombies ones I'm not entirely sure how I'm gonna work those ones just because obviously when you're working on like an easter egg and stuff like that some of the steps take a while and then you've got rounds where you just have to like go farm for kills and things like that. I don't know whether or not to kind of keep those little snippets in or whether to get rid of them completely. It can make the video really long like I think the terminus easter egg was um it took us around an hour and 40 minutes to fully complete um just because we had to you know farm for some kills to get points up and everything like that like it just takes its time. I'm pretty sure sure the Liberty Falls one was a little bit over an hour but nowhere near as long I don't think as the other one. See like I, I literally don't even have to use my brain there. That is how broken this perk is. It's actually uh, multiple people have already gotten dark matter which is insane. It looks so good in this game though. It really does. Massive fan of the original of course. Black Ops 3 was the first one um, that had it and one of the games that I played a lot. Like, I I literally no life that game. It was insane. I'm in hardcore just for the uh, one-shot headshots, but um, I'm currently getting my ass handed to me. <laughs> yeah, I just kind of wanted to get something out on the multiplayer because, like, I literally hadn't put anything up. Uh, just kind of doing a little bit of an update. Ignore how absolutely terrible this is going. Yeah, I guess that's kind of it.